It is 5.05 p.m. Tuesday, early evening, January 31st, 2023. We're on the Westbound Empire Builder, Amtrak train number seven, headed from Chicago Union Station to Seattle, Washington. We're in the Superliner Sightseer Lounge Car. Next stop, Williston, North Dakota. We were due to arrive Williston at 11.59 a.m. And at our last stop, Minot, North Dakota, five freight trains were sent ahead of us, three were sent east before we could depart, and then the announcement was made that one of the two Portland, Oregon Superliner coaches was going to be set out due to flat wheels. Now the cost is as follows. Two Siemens Charger locomotives, each with a Cummins diesel engine. One General Electric P42 diesel electric locomotive. One baggage car. Two Superliner sleeping cars the second one i'm in room at h on the lower level one superliner dining car one superliner coach for seattle well the two superliner sleepers are going to seattle superliner the superliner dining car is going to seattle and uh and then a Superliner coach for Seattle, the Superliner sightseer lounge car for Seattle. It was going to be two Superliner coaches for Portland, but since one was set out at Minot, North Dakota, and now there is one, one Superliner coach for Portland, Oregon, one Superliner sleeper for Portland, Oregon, and one deadheading baggage car for Portland, Oregon. Regarding the rear, the deadheading baggage car, before we could depart Chicago Union Station yesterday, January 30th, well, we were all boarded and then there was announcement that the yard, the Amtrak yard of Chicago forgot to fix a broken, non-functioning taillight on the rear baggage car. So we had to wait while the taillight was was uh, replaced at Chicago Union Station. And first, I was in the Metropolitan Lounge at Chicago, Chicago Union Station. Announcement was made, was made there'd be an estimated one hour delay due to an engine problem, but then later on was the taillight announcement. Coming into Williston, North Dakota, Got out and took photos at uh, Minot, North Dakota, and it was six degrees Fahrenheit. Was this uh, former NP or GN? Great Northern. This is now Burlington Northern Santa Fe all the way railway, but it was Great Northern Railway. And the original operator of this Empire Builder was the Great Northern Railway. Looks like there's a GP18 over here, Russ. Uh-huh. No, I'm taking a video. Think we're making the station stop? Yes, the station's, uh, the museum is uh, up the hill there, and the station is to the, uh, to the right. You see the locomotive over there? So maybe we're going to take, uh, make two station stops. He said we would be. Too. We're going to make two station stops.
due to the length of the tree and the length of the platform. Let's go across the aisle and watch the action. There's a freight switching. GB38 in front, Dan. And uh, this one here looks like a GP18, this yellow locomotive. GP8, my retiree buddy Dan thinks this is uh, this yellow locomotive is a GP18. <laughs> Here's a BNSF freight switching here at Williston, North Dakota. Probably lead units at EMD Electromoto GP38. I don't see the museum, Dan. Oh, there it is, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a museum up on the hill there in the distance. It looks like a Northern Pacific caboose. Green, ca green Northern Pacific caboose. It's a, it's a great Northern steam. Great Northern steam locomotive. There's the Green Northern Pacific Caboose. It's got a green jacket on the boiler, too. And then the Great Northern Steam Locomotive. High ball, Williston, North Carolina, North Dakota.
Depot is coming up. Here's the Williston Depot. Coming up, some green elevators. It's like grain covered hoppers, covered hoppers for grain loading. Maybe they're already loaded. Next stop will be Wolf Point, Montana. Yeah, next stop will be in Montana, Wolf Point, Montana. And we're due there at 12.34 p.m. And it's now 5.17 p.m. Departing Devil's Lake, North Dakota, we had 59 passengers in the three Superliner coaches and 37 passengers in the three Superliner sleeping cars. Right now we're on Central Time, but Wolf Point will be on Mountain Time. Mountain Time, Wolf Point, Montana. We departed Chicago Union Station at 5.29 p.m. yesterday evening instead of the scheduled 3.05 p.m. departure. And we departed Minot, North Dakota at 3.20 p.m. this afternoon instead of the scheduled 9.06 a.m. departure.
Well, was it in Williston, Dan? I don't know. But it's, a, it's 11 LaGrange Park, 23 and Hamper. 11 in LaGrange Park now, 23 in Hamper. And 40 in um, Everwood. Look at those deer tracks. Deer tracks that come down here from the train. It is 521 p.m. Tuesday early evening January 31st 2023 aboard the Superliner Sightseer Lounge Car the westbound Amtrak train number 7 Empire Builder headed from Chicago Union Station to Seattle Washington west of Williston North Dakota over and out. <laughs> 